Welcome back to my channel. My name is Linus and I am here with another video. I'm back again, guys. I was gone and gone and gone and gone, but I'm finally back, okay? And I have a little bit of a cold, but I feel much better today. And it's been very gloomy outside, so I thought, why not film a video? And in today's video, I wanted to do something that I have never done on this channel. So I am going to be doing my makeup. Do not be impressed, okay? I've only doing, been doing makeup seriously for like three years, okay? So it's a little bit, <laughs> you know, it's a lot of work, but it's makeup. All right, so make sure you give this video a thumbs up, like, like and comment down below, and let me know if you guys want me to do any other videos i'm gonna show you all the products that i have and what i'm gonna be using it's honestly all over the place but um we'll see how things go i'm excited to mess it all up and have some fun okay let's go first of all i'm gonna tie this hair and um just get it out of my face so i have so much of this hair on my head so i can't tie the whole thing i can't do the whole bun so i i have part of it down there also when you're doing your makeup make sure your face is clean like this it's clean there's nothing there's no product so wash it don't just get don't just use the remover i use this kind of this remover but i hate it because it burns my face so liza mm, i got my eyes on you this hurts so bad like it like it's oh it just burns my face so you can try it but i don't like it so make sure your face is clean before you go into all that makeup um wipe it all clean and make sure it's kind of moisturized i put some lotion on there so we'll see how it goes also i'm listening to all the old zambian songs because independence is almost here and i miss home so I have to i have to listen to these songs so what am i gonna do let's see i'm gonna go and uh put some some of this on my face because it it feels a little bit dry so we're gonna oh gosh we're gonna go do that and just kind of moisturize it a little because it's a little bit crusty um yeah i don't i mean i wouldn't say i'm like the best makeup artist there i'm not don't even don't even i am not i'm very i'm like i'm very bad at makeup i don't follow the rules so you probably don't want to um you probably don't want to follow what i do just because you're gonna be screwed okay um also i use a, bu a bunch of cheap stuff and i know that for your face it's recommendable that you actually kind of have money um but you know what i don't have money so it is what it is i use what i use <laughs> you know what i'm saying so like this my skin it feels a little bit more moisturized so what i do first because i know this is all about my face if i was getting ready which is what i'm doing now is i would do my eyebrows so i have i have um different kinds of brushes so i have i mostly have this one this kind is what i use a lot um but then i have this kind it's called kiss but yo i am scared to use these brushes because i'm like i'm so bad i'm still really bad and these are like really really good brushes they're very very thick and they're heavy and so my stupid self what i did was i only used one of them and i used this little one for my br for my um for my eyebrows because it brushes them really well and this is supposed to be like for the lining of them but i don't use it because i'm scared okay i'm scared so we're gonna go in and brush them um eyebrows and you want to make sure you brush them upward i mean that's what i do nobody taught me how to do it i just do it is it wrong i don't know so you brush them upward and upward and upward and upward like that and i just want to tell you that um i have tried using like the um it's like more like a creamy kind of eye um 
I um like eyebrow pencil. I don't really know, but I always use this kind. Okay, this so like you see how you see this? This is what I use, but I also have this big one. I just it's so dark for me that I don't want to use it. So I always go in and use this tiny one, which is about to finish, but it's fine. So what I do is I because I'm using this is my um mirror, it has the magnifier on here and just the regular on here. So I go in, I bring it this close to my face and i just follow i basically just follow my brows you know what i'm saying it might be wrong um but i don't know and i've heard you shouldn't do it as dark but i'm doing it dark you know what i'm saying because i don't know but i'm trying to why am i even showing you guys because i don't know what i'm doing okay so then i go like that and like that and then i do, 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 do. i kind of go like that you won't really see it that much on here because i'm not really like it's not that dark in there so let me do it and then i'll show you guys what it looks like okay. i'm pretty sure you want to laugh right now go ahead it's fine okay so then when i do that i go in and i brush them upwards upwards like this this upwards and then once you brush them upwards honestly i don't feel i feel like this part really can look terrible i mean just saying you see how i'm looking it can look very bad um but that's why we go in and uh clean up all these messes so i use these three this is what i use for my face but i also use it for my brows okay you don't have to go extra and let me tell you all of them are foundations that's how bad things are foundation this is actually this is concealer foundation foundation it's just darker and that's what i use for my face every day every single time so let me show you okay so this is what i do i take this one because it's lighter for my skin and i know i should have like a palette where i should put it but i don't have one so you know screw me so then i put it on here and it, it works you know what i'm saying when you don't have money you gotta do what you gotta do and then you see my stupid self instead of using this brush because i'm scared i go and use this brush okay so then i just you know kind of just drop some like that on there and then i mix it up you know i don't know i can't tell you how long i've had this but i'm telling you i've had this for too long i probably should throw it away because i'm pretty sure it, it it has expired okay um but i don't have money so it is what it is such is life so see i mixed it up and then i go in make sure i'm looking at what i'm doing i go and then i line it up like that you know what i'm saying you see you see let me do it and then i'll show you guys okay. make sure so this is what i have and make sure when you're using this dabby thingy thingy magic it's wet so i put some water in there and i'm just gonna kind of like not kind of mix it in in there okay because we don't want it to be um too showy showy like that the way it's showing um so what i would do is i would go in with a brush because i have two of these one one i love this one because i've used this so many times and it works then i use this one because i don't know i just don't use it that much and so i would go in and kind of you know what i'm saying make it look clean a little um and then try to blend it in don't worry it will blend in eventually um because i'm gonna go in with a darker color too darker shade so then at least it blends in and you know what i always think or say is that um you know sometimes you don't even have to do your um your eyebrows if you can't do them just do your whole just do your your lashes and you should be golden to go you know um and so then i go in with this one this is my uh skin color and then i put a little on there i put a little on there so i can blend it in again and then i use that for my upper lid or upper eyebrow um so then i go in and i do the upper part but you want to make sure when you do the upper part that the um you're using a darker shade okay okay so the brows are not perfect but i'm telling you you can survive with this okay you can survive and this usually doesn't take me that long so it shouldn't take you long either i keep losing my brush here we go okay so then you go in and you kind of you know i just kind of um try to blend it in before i put my 
foundation on because guys remember this whole process i've been using foundations literally look this is a foundation if you can read it and let me see and this is a foundation read right there that's a foundation and this is a concealer this is a concealer right there i don't have any expensive stuff and i do my makeup literally with those things and people be like oh i love your makeup and i'm like mm, thank you i use i use i use foundation for my face but it's fine um so before i blend it in with this one this darker foundation plus this foundation i am going to do my edges because i don't like how they're looking and then i'm also gonna part my hair into two little buns because i've been liking how that looks and then we'll come and finish the rest of the look i'm excited if i tell you how long it's taken me to do these buns because i don't even think they even guys uh, it's literally taking me so long anyways i'm gonna do my edges and what i'm gonna use is this thing and this is my um and here is the gel and the glue okay so glue uh age control and gel that's what i use let me do it and we'll see okay so once i do my edges i go in and i this is my do rag but i just kind of like put it in like this because it's already sleek it doesn't like uh it doesn't stick to my scalp or to my skin when uh drying my edges so i go in and i tie it like this and then i do my face so this is this is basically how i do my face is i do my edges first and then i just realized i wasn't playing music i have to have the music so i do my edges like this guys then i go in and tie it and then i do the rest of my face so as you can see we can have boundaries and borders and all that stuff so when i'm done like putting all my makeup on here then i remove it and i do the rest of it and blend it in so i can match my face okay so i'm gonna put away the products and then i'm going to work on my face and show you um that i indeed use foundation for my face so i go in and okay i know this is like a setting powder a setting spray but guys i still use it okay i don't know how to do makeup so i go in like this mm -hmm. blow a little because i want my my face to be moisturized because the last time i put the the oil on uh the moisturizer on it was it's been a while so we gotta kind of redo it and so this thing becoming my face and so i put you know little dots around so um this one is way lighter for my skin so i don't i can't use this whole thing so i have to go in with this one which is darker for my skin so if that doesn't tell you anything i don't know what my shade is uh hopefully i will figure out that soon because i i am struggling so then i go in and i dab make sure you're dabbing like this and not smearing you're dabbing so let me dab around and i'll show you guys once it's all dabbed in and this one i put it on here for longer but since this is just a video and i'm not going anywhere oh gosh i'm about to do this i am going to uh remove it and this is how my edges look like this and yes i do them myself sometimes they don't really like stick but they're good enough for what i can do okay and so i go in and i dab the side so i can kind of mix it in um so usually you're supposed to do the makeup all the way up to here some people do it and i'm not gonna do that okay i'm just not doing it okay so then i dab like this like this i dab you see and my face naturally it's very smooth like i have a very smooth uh, surface so it's easy to put on makeup and blend it in and so once you blend you go in and you brush this okay because i didn't want to have too thick of brows because i naturally don't have brows anyway so i don't want to have too much and i don't want to have too little so then it looks like this this is like in the middle my buns i think one is bigger than the other but it's fine okay so then i go in with the concealer i go and line up here i put little dots little dots because i'm pretty sure i'm not supposed to be doing this but i'm doing it you know what i'm saying because that's how i do my makeup <laughs> 
<laughs> yes, so then I go in with this weight. Like, I mean, you gotta, it has to be damp. And then I go under there. Guys, I don't really know why we do this, but I do it because <laughs> I've seen other people do it. So let's do it. There, we got it. I got it. You can't really see the difference, but you see what, what these two can do for you. These are concealers, guys, concealers. You don't need to have all these expensive stuff. The only expensive things I own, one of them is probably this one, and I got this by mistake. This is one of the expensive things I own. And this brush I got from my grand my grandparents. These brushes. And I think um this Movi palette. And I'm not sure where I got this um Acline heel. I don't know where I got that from. Okay, I just know I got it. This was my friend's and she gave it to me and um you know i don't know how i don't know like how much it cost i don't know i just i was given and so <clears throat> you don't need a, a lot of expensive things to look good you know what i'm saying you just you just don't you know you only need two things and then things to do with your your brows you need literally can you see that i made i did my brows using this i did my brows using this <laughs> One that one that shall never end. Okay, then I'm gonna go fix my lashes in my eye, and I use this and this. Okay, reasons why I use this is, guys, I tried out this one. It's called uh, strip lash ad ad eh? adhesive adhesive. I can't read. That's what that one is. And then this one is lash glue liner. This, if you like to do your lashes, you should get this one. This one is perfect let me show you why i love it you see the tip you see the tip but you gotta be careful because once you put it on your skin pa, then it lines already but this is my old one and i got a new one and i have to say i don't know where i put it okay i'm gonna check my drawers um Ooh, i found it i found the new one i mean guys do you understand the struggle so okay since i found the new one i don't need to use this old one so or this one so this one is basically uh kind of liquidy it's a little bit liquid so then i'm gonna go use the new one that i found on my face guys i thought i lost it again oh my gosh okay so this is it i'm just gonna line it through um my eye my eye my lashes my eyelash my yeah i'm gonna I always pull my lashes like this because I'm not that advanced. And then I just, you see, it's like, it's an eyeliner glue. So it works perfectly. And then I go like that. So then I'm done. And these are the lashes that I use. Um, They're called, they're just Kiss 3D. So they kind of, you feel the heaviness. And so they're kind of long. And the rule with lashes is that before you put them on, Oh, I need the music. Before you put them on, you need to measure the size. And if they're longer than your eyelid or your whatever, then you gotta cut them, okay? So I already cut this because I've used them before and I'm using them again. I mean, why not use them again? Okay, so I'm using them again. And so I go in, I stick the middle like this. I don't know if you can see. I stick the middle okay and then i go in i move it around i move it around and then i stick the ends and the two ends and bam they've entered they're in you know what i'm saying and do i do them perfectly no but do they stick yes and i kind of go in like that just to make sure you know like they're that they're in but they're not like looking crazy and then i go in with the uh, right side i do the same thing you stick the middle boom and then you kind of move them around and then you go and stick the two ends like that and boom you know what i'm saying like that boom 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 and you're in yes you know but lashes literally they finish your whole look like you could be looking ratchet and you just do your lashes and you will look good my friends okay so i just make sure that they're in they're in they're in okay there there okay 
so then what i do guys is it's not that much i go in with mothy and and um my other one which fell over here let me get it and this one it is by jacqueline and i use i'm gonna use two colors okay just two i am going to use actually on here i'm gonna use two colors this color this is per, like a purplish and this other purple i'll do them all and i will show you i use this brush right here okay so i do this and then i do this okay and then i go like this let me show you what i do i go like this because i know people be telling me like i like your um i like your eyeshadow that's why you don't do it on the screen i'm just saying people be telling me i like your eyeshadow and i'm like honestly i'm not the best at eyeshadow because i don't know how to blend so this is what i do i just put them here like this i do the same color on this side and then i do it on the other side too and then i just clean this brush because i mean why not i don't know how to use different brushes that's just me i'm not a makeup uh, expert like i told you guys um so yeah and then for this one this is this is also mothy oh it's just got jackline here but it's mothy um and i use this one right here if you can see i love i love this one so i'm gonna use that one and i'll do the same thing so let me do it and show you guys look at that look at that yo look at that so i go in and i do this you see it's basically oh my gosh you know that happens but you just kind of correct it just to move on it dun, 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 dun. As I get an easy Hey, Karen, on guy, way. Let me put that you volume in way. Ooh, hey. When you go down, pick it up. Go down, pick it up. Go down, pick it up. And then I put this color on the other side. Go down, pick it up. Go down, pick it up. Go down, pick it up. Go down. You see, it's so easy and it's so cheap, guys. It's very cheap. You can look good with cheap makeup, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so this is how I do it. I just transfer this color that's over here, over here, transfer the one that's over here, over here, and you know, bam, I'm done. Done. okay and then i gotta do i put a little bit of this um i'm not really sure what this is called but you know it works miracles it works wonders so i get my my pointy finger i put some on my nose and i try to stretch it out and i put some on my cheeks because i don't know makeup um but i do what i can do i survive with what i have and then i get one of these brushes i go in and kind of move it around so it's not looking ratchet Just to move on. 
Kale Mongaiwe, Manja Sivanga, Ponzi, Sunda, Vamino Chita. Oh, 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 when you go down, pick it up. Go down, pick it up. For my, these are decos for my hair, so I'm gonna put them on. I have a couple here that I'll just plug in. Hey. Go down, pick it up. 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 Oh, you wait. I'm gonna pick up. Yeah. You original. Shoot him down when a criminal. Never look at me when I see me now. Very original. The Pangetro Green. I'm done. This is how I do my makeup. Literally, every time I go to class, this is me. Also, if you're looking for something for your lips, ladies, this is good. This is good stuff, okay? This is um lip oil. It has argan oil and vitamin E. It's good for your lips, okay? I'm not advertising, but this is good. So, let me moisturize my lips. Mm.